Hi, this is Tim Matt, is this any good.com? And I'm here with a very quick guide around some of the specifications of the Nintendo 3DS system. You can see I've got the uh, rather fetching blue colour. It's also available in red and black. Now, um, the top screen is a wide screen and it's about an 800 by 240 resolution and it's capable of displaying 16 million colours. The bottom is the touch screen and that's a 320 by 240 resolution and um, that's also capable of displaying 16 million colours. Now it's got a gyro sensor within it so that's great for moving around the games with the actual system moving around as well and it's also got built-in wireless technology for connecting to the internet and also for connecting to your friend's system it's enabled with street pass so you can um, pick up other players data literally as you pass them in the street it's also got things like spot pass which gives regular updates from the uh, software manufacturers to your games so that's great news as well it's got loads of other features obviously the main one is the glasses free 3D technology now that's a stereoscopic 3D and it works it brilliantly well so that's pretty much it I'm gonna go straight into the review now hi this is Tim from is this any good.com and here's my review of the Nintendo 3DS console now this has been out for a few months now since the end of March 2011 and it's a replacement of the um, ever popular Nintendo DS system and the latest incarnation of that was the DSi now you can have a very quick look at it from the outside very similar to the DS Lite it's almost identical in size and um, the big difference is of course you've got the uh, 3D slider on the side and some of the controls have been swapped around you've got a wireless connection on the side as well you've got your indicators, your charge indicator, sleep indicator at the front headphone socket and on the side you've got your volume control and an SD card slot and it comes with a standard 2 gigabyte SD card it also comes with the uh, docking cradle which is this and the uh, power adapter now quickly turning over to the back you can see where the uh, game cartridge goes in now this is fully backwards compatible with all uh, Nintendo DS games as well and I haven't managed to find a, a DS game that it doesn't work with so should work with everything and you've got the uh, left and right shoulder buttons and your um, power adapter goes in there so you can see on the front is the um, two cameras which make up the 3D camera so it has got a full 3D camera um, in the console and inside there's another camera you can see my face as well unlucky for you and that's the one you can take your pictures on to put in the games etc and we'll turn our attention now to the bottom part of it just quickly turn it on so you can see the traditional um, cross pad but now we've got the uh, rather nice joy pad which works really really well it's very smooth and it works perfectly on all the games we've then got the uh, traditional four buttons X, Y, B, A to control all your games and here's the uh, 3D slider which um, obviously you're not going to be able to see the 3D but you can see that you can turn the effect up or down now we'll run through what it's got on the system and um, quickly so first of all we've got Nintendo eShop now you can um, get all sorts of videos and downloads and you can download games which you have to pay for you also get a few freebies now and there's a, another freebie game coming out um, on September the 28th which is the um, Legend of Zelda Four Swords so that's a freebie and there's been a couple of others as well including Excite Bike, which is an old NES game now next to that we've got the uh, music player and uh, Nintendo 3DS sound system you can create music effects and uh, you can actually load some of your music on there if you want uh, the next th thing along is the AR games now these are the unique uh, 3D augmented reality 
and this is quite a unique feature on this system and it really is something to behold playing it in full 3D where literally your table can start to move a dragon will appear out of a box it's really really innovative and um, looking forward to Nintendo to using it in some more games very soon go through a few more of the other features it's got activity log monitors obviously everything you've done um, on the system game play time and all sorts of features like that and um, we've got our me maker which is obviously where you can make your me to make it look like yourself and your friends and store it on the system you can also play through various things within that as well we've got one of the um, unique uh, games. This one's Face Raiders and you can see I've got my ugly mug put on this and you can basically take pictures of your friends and yourself and go around shooting yourself. And we've got Download Play and we've got a ton of other features as well. We've got System Settings where you can change all your system settings. Just some health and safety information. And here's the Street Pass Me Plaza. So there's an absolute bucket of stuff on the uh, system. Now, um, quickly turn on to the uh, games. And um, I'm just going to show you some of those. So you can see some of the games out for it. I see some of these are some of the best games available. So we've got uh, Legend of Zelda in the corner. Star Fox 64, which has recently come out. Ghost Recon, Dead or Alive, Resident Evil Mercenaries. Street Fighter 3D Edition. Those are about the six best games out for the system. There are a whole ton of others available. You can see I've got a few more out. And uh, you can see like Pilot Wings, Cubic Ninja. They're a bit more of a quirky gameplay. And um, we've got the traditional film type. We've got Thor. We've got like a driver game, Pac Man Gallagher. So there is a whole variety of games. And there's a whole ton more coming out soon, including um, all the um, Mario games, etc. Now the um, 3D camera is going to get an update into a 3D video camera as well for you in September and uh, the whole system really is a really nice system. It's a great upgrade from the uh, DSi. The graphics are hugely improved and the 3D effect, obviously I can't show you unfortunately in a video, but the 3D really is a unique feature and it does make the games really stand out, especially in some of the the uh, stellar titles like Star Fox 64 and Zelda playing it in 3D some of the sections really is something to behold the sound is excellent and the whole system is really well built and of course it is now been reduced in price so uh, it's much more affordable it's around about $129.99 in the UK about $169 in the US so what do I think of the uh, Nintendo 3DS system as a whole well, I think it's an excellent system. It has lacked a few um, stellar titles to begin with, but they're all beginning to filter out now. And Nintendo are starting to put in the upgrades for the system, like the um, 3D video camera, and they're going to be bringing a whole lot more very soon. So, is this any good? Well, of course it is. It's a Nintendo con console, and I think it's absolutely excellent. You've got access to the internet, and you've got loads of stuff which I've showed you just some of. Now the internet is just a little bit um, well it's not 100% because it's not flash enabled but again hopefully Nintendo are going to upgrade that. So as a whole I give it a massive thumbs up it definitely is good and I will give it a score of 9 out of 10. So this has been Tim at isthisanygood.com thanks for watching.